Hey guys, it's Shelby. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing another video in my hashtag Shelby Claus series. And today I'm going to be doing like a gift guide kind of video. Um, just to give you guys some ideas or gifts for like your parents, your family members, um, friends, and yeah, stuff like that. So let's get right into it. So the first category that I'm going to be talking to you guys about today is parents. And I know that sometimes parents can be very, very hard to shop for just because you're not really sure what you want to get them. And like, if you're in like, if you're like my age, um, where you're a little bit older and you want them, you want to get them like a nicer gift, but you don't really have the money to get them a nicer gift. Um, the first thing that I always do is just talk to the other parents. So like if you're getting, wanting to get something for your mom, then talk to your dad about the thing that you want to get for your mom and vice versa. And maybe they could like help. For example, I really, really wanted to get this thing for my mom. And I talked to my dad about it and he was like, oh yeah, that's okay. We can go get it right now. And I was so, so, so excited because I didn't know what he was going to say. So yesterday we went to Bed Bath & Beyond and we got my mom um, the Fitbit Flex. And a lot of you guys probably already know what this is and have seen it before because a lot of people have been talking about this. Um, this is a perfect gift. Um, it's under $100. And if you have a coupon, a 20% off coupon from Bed Bath & Beyond, we got this for $84, which is a great price for this. Um, if you don't know what it is, it measures, it's just a little um, bracelet and it measures your activity, like your exercising. It measures your sleep. Um, you can set goals with it. And it also has a corresponding app that you can put on your phone um, so you can keep track of everything. And the best part is, as well, you can use it for multiple people. So um, if all three of my family members wanted to use this, we could if my mom will let us. But um, yeah, so this is just a great gift to get for your mom. The next thing that's really, really good to get for your mom is just um, talk to her. If she wears makeup, the best thing to get her would be like a new palette or just whatever she needs. Um, I talked to my mom a while ago and she need, was almost, she uses one palette and she was almost running out of it. So they did, they did discontinue the palette. So I couldn't get her the exact palette, which was kind of annoying, but, um, I did get her a similar palette. And, um, it was, you can, the palettes can range in price, but you can always go buy a drugstore palette, um, drugstore if you're on a smaller budget. The next idea for your mom is, depending on how active she is, you can get her, um, like, a pass to a gym membership, or you could get her, like, um, a pass to, like, yoga classes. I know... My mom and I always used to go to yoga and then we just got super, super busy and we don't really go anymore. So um, I know that I most likely will be getting her probably a thing, like a little coupon thing um, for us to go back to yoga because I know she's been talking about it lately a lot. Um, so yeah, you could always get them like a gym membership or things like that. Okay, the next thing is also a gift from, for your mom, but I suggest giving this idea to your dad, um, or if you have a brother that has a girlfriend or something, you can tell them, um, they can get their girlfriend or wife or whatever a little coupon for a romantic date. It doesn't have to be romantic or whatever. They could just go and take them to dinner. You could go to the movies, pretty much whatever they want to do. Just have like a nice night. And if you have siblings that you would need to take care of, make sure that you um, t 
tell them that you would be willing to take care of your siblings for the night if they need to be taken care of. Um, just so your parents can have a nice night out because every once in a while all parents need to go out and have a nice night like that. So yeah, that'd be an awesome gift idea. And lastly, just get hints from your mom. Like honestly, I have pretty open communication with my mom. So I always just am asking her like what she needs, just like what she does to me. But I just do the same thing and it's just like casual conversation and none of us even like we don't even know um, really what if it's for Christmas or birthdays or something. Um, so yeah, you can always ask them what they need or just kind of survey it out. So my mom, it gives it's like a big pet peeve of mine. She always is wearing my old guard jacket and it bothers me a lot um, just because I... It doesn't look good on her and I want her to look nice um, and like I don't go to that school anymore so I don't want her like to be walking around wearing it and it just doesn't look nice especially for her so um, I got her I don't have a thing of it I already I wrapped it but I got her a new sweatshirt and it's the same color it looks exactly the same as the one that she always wears except there's no writing on it and it's just a plain sweatshirt um, and then also if you saw my Black Friday haul I also got her a black jacket that's kind of like a sweatshirt in one um, so yeah just kind of survey um, and just keep your eyes open and ears open and try noticing things that she likes or wants. And the last idea for your mom is just if she is a chocolate lover or a candy lover, you can always go to Seize Candy if there's one by you. I know we have, I have one right by me. Um, you can always go to Seize Candy and get a certificate or you can just, if you know what she likes, you can always just get her a box and just put it under the tree. I know my dad every year, he, for pretty much every holiday, he gets my mom and I um, a little box of Seize Candy. And it's just so sweet because we love chocolate, so it's, it's really great. So you can always do that, um, even if you have, like, another... Brand. doesn't really matter. okay and next is gifts for your dad and I know I am super super close to my dad but he is just so picky and it is so hard because he never tells me that he wants anything for Christmas but then it's like okay well I don't know what to get you then but I want to get you something nice um so yeah here's a few ideas for your dad Okay, so the first thing that I always, we always get this for him every year, um, pretty much without fail, we have a world market by us, and I don't know how many places around, I don't know how many like places they're in, but I think they're pretty much nationwide, um, or you have something like it. It's world market, and pretty much there's just a bunch of um different things from different countries and stuff in that store and um, they come out every year with this pack of beer called Beers of the World and I don't know what got us started on it but every year we just buy it for him because um, they have really cool names and they have different flavors and stuff and he really likes it and it's only like $15 um, so yeah, we always get him a little pack of that from World Market, and he always loves it. Next is, like, pajama wear, or just cozy, he calls it cozy wear. Um, I don't know about you guys, but my dad is always cold. Like, he's te very temperature sensitive, and he's always cold or always hot. Um, so he loves wearing, like, sweatpants all the time. Um, so every year we always get him a new pair of pajama pants, which are just normal pajama pants because he wears his so often that they just get disgusting. Um, so yeah, you could always get him pajama pants or you could get him like some workout stuff. I know my dad doesn't have very many workout stuff. Um, again, same thing with my mom, just stuff, just kind of survey what they need. 
Um, like, I know for sure my dad needs new jeans. Like, his jeans are so bad. I don't even want to be around him in public with them on. So, I know for sure we are getting him some jeans for Christmas because he needs them so badly. The next idea, this is a bigger idea, um, like a more expensive one. I did a bigger idea for your mom, so I thought I'd include this. Um, you can, And they also range in price. You can either get a cheaper one or a more expensive one. This And it's a tablet. Now, my dad does not have a tablet yet. Um, but you could, you could, like, the cheaper ones are, like, a Kindle Fire, and right now those are, like, $60, which isn't that bad. Um, or you could always just, if you want, have more of a budget, you could get a, um, iPad, and those are more expensive. Those are, like, $400, $500, $600, so if you're willing to spend that much, go ahead, but, um, not everyone has the money to do that, so... Yeah, a tablet would be a great idea. Next also ranges in price, and you could get him an iPod. Now, my dad only has a tiny little iPod shuffle, but he loves that thing to death. He, I helped him put um, some music on it that he already had off of like CDs and stuff, and he loves that thing so much. Oh my gosh. But it's kind of scary when he uses it because he puts his headphones in and he blasts it so loud and yeah, it's he cannot hear anything. So I would suggest getting him an iPod if he's like a music lover. Pretty much everyone would like an iPod. And I just got him a little tiny iPod shuffle. It was like 50 bucks and he is obsessed with it. So. And my last idea for your dad is tickets to a game. My dad is obsessed with going to all the games. Um, he loves going to the USC game with my brother because we are huge USC fans and Yankee fans. Um, <laughs> so he loves going to the games with my brother. So if you want to like give him a special experience, you, that would be a really fun gift you could give your dad and if you have a brother as well or whoever your dad likes to go to the games with, um, you could give him that. And this is also a really good idea for like a boyfriend if you have that or a brother. Pretty much any guy in your family, just give them tickets to pretty much any game. Just make sure it's like a team that they like. <laughs> um, and yeah, it's like a perfect perfect gift for guys because they love that kind of stuff.